this recording was sent in by Lewis, and he tells me that he found it in the paranormal subreddit. Apparently it was captured by a property owner, who was waiting to catch the reason for some of the disturbances his family had to face in the past couple of nights. The motion sensor turned on several times and activated their security cameras outside of their property, and it's only supposed to do that should it recognize either a human or animal. But each time the camera got triggered, nothing ever showed up on the safe recordings. However, the following night was different, and when the man checked the recordings in the morning, he found something really strange looking. It appears that a woman is walking into the screen from the right side, but how? She must have been on the property already, since the entrance gate is to the left. Another oddity about this clip is that the woman just stops in her tracks and then disappears into thin air. Was it an artifact that was possibly caused by the rain? But that wouldn't trigger the emotion alert. Maybe the spirit of a lady who was visiting their property. The following clip was sent to me by Ayumi and she told me that she had it in her collection for quite some time. It was recorded by two friends in a high school, who were part of a dance class and were practicing some moves after regular hours in their classroom. Nothing really weird popped up at the time, and they didn't think that anything scary unfolded that afternoon. That is, however, after re-watching their dance rehearsal at home, they had to change their minds, as you will see for yourself in a minute. Two girls swore that nobody else was with them in the classroom. Can we believe that? The potato camera says otherwise. A friend perhaps, or something otherworldly. A creepy encounter for sure. Earlier this week we have taken a look at the haunting which takes place in the apartment of Remy Coat. Poltergeist activity as well as an eerie apparition can be captured, almost on a daily basis at this point. She has asked for help on Reddit, but to this day nobody was really able to help her. Last night she has placed two camcorders to capture the latest happenings, and this is what was recorded. Listen closely. For some reason, the ornaments which are mounted to the ceiling seem to be moved, just like the plant underneath. And then watch between the clock on the wall and the picture, it seems to be getting darker there for some reason. And where do these noises come from? Creepy for sure, but what really took the cake is the following capture that Raimi could come up with. She states, the shadow person was in my bedroom, next to the door where I captured the video. 
Could it be the same ghost figure she had caught on video earlier? What do you think? The next was captured by channel The Oslaskans, and it appeared that a mysterious event has caused the man in the following video to actually get out his cell phone. He tells us about really odd noises he was hearing in the past couple of nights, and that he even noticed shadows in the corner of his eyes. Apparently he was situated in a pretty old building, and I assume he's at his workplace. That's So it's about 2 o'clock in the morning. Um, I've been working in the studio, and the last couple of nights I've been hearing really creepy sounds. Um, I've been hearing footsteps, and, and, um, and like seeing things out of the corner of my eye. Now this is a really big old building, and so that's got me a little bit freaked out, but the top of it was just a, a few minutes ago, I was going to the bathroom, and I was standing in the stall, and I swear someone grabbed the back of my shoulder while I was standing there. If, uh, if something happens, I want to have it on video. First things first, checking that no other human soul is around. Then he tries to make it towards the toilet stalls, you know, to possibly record proof that something is still lingering there. A scary looking face is peeking at our cameraman here. The eyes are reflecting in a suspicious way, which causes some commenters to believe this might have been a ghost. What do you think? Was it a colleague of his that was pranking him that night? Or did this man capture something from another realm? The first series of videos were recorded by a user called Frolylicious Music. He has shared the following clip, which was recorded by his son. Apparently the young man woke up to one of his electronics, which turned on all by itself. It was hard to see, but there appeared to be something really creepy on it.
Does this appear like a face to you? Some say this is the case. But other stuff kept happening in their house. Around 3 a.m., Frolilicious woke up to some really inexplicable noises from the bathroom. He recorded the incident. This is what he saw. We can see that a cloaked figure is walking by, very fast in the bathroom. Unfortunately, he did not go in and turn the light on to figure out what was going on. But what do you think happened here? Is this house haunted or is this just a prank? This video was posted by Nadok for real. He states that he moved into a new apartment, that he is sure that it is haunted. He hears voices in the middle of the night and even sees shadows every now and then. He has placed several cameras in his place. One night, the following creepy message was left for him. What do you think? Could it be the spirit of the former owner perhaps? At least that's what some commenters suggested. Could it be? Most of you know, a few weeks ago I started looking at the case of Remy Code, who shares her encounters with a terrifying shadow apparition on her Reddit profile. She has placed several cameras in her apartment to capture all of this activity, which unfolds mostly while she is asleep. Tonight she believes to have captured a shadow moving out of a chair. Take a look. Remy states that it's not a reflection from the other side of the room, and since she was alone and sleeping, was it the same apparition that she had captured weeks prior? Let me know. The following is a recording that occurred at a police station in Serbia around 9 p.m. at night. A woman entered the station and stated that she was being followed by somebody, that she doesn't feel safe. The police station was located just a couple of blocks away from her home. So instead of leading that stalker straight to her house, she filed a report. The officers were just filing the report about this mysterious stalker and actually thought that the woman might have been under the influence since she stated that this person was vanishing ever so often and that they were even floating sometimes. While she was still telling her crazy story, the following occurrence was captured on one of the CCTV cameras of the station. A strange white figure can be seen, floating above the ground of the police station, and nobody had an idea what was going on. Many people believe this to be the mysterious stalker that followed this woman into the police station. So, 
Are we looking at a real ghost here? Or what was going on in that hallway? The officer stated that they had never seen such a thing on their screen. Your thoughts? The next video was sent by Felix S. and he states that he found it on Taro Animasi. It was captured by a young woman one night while she was jogging. He told me that she has a body camera on her for security reasons, since you never know what you come across alone at night. As she was starting her round that night, she noticed that somebody else seemed to be running right next to her. But what's really weird is that this mysterious person just vanished in front of her. Then we see this person again and as before no trace can be found. Then, all of a sudden, that thing is running towards her, but backwards. And the woman is running away in fear. Some people say that it might have been a malevolent entity that wanted to spook the woman that night. Others believe it to be a film project. Who knows, it's definitely terrifying. The following video was uploaded by user Bunnytoes. She states the following. Unknown voice, unknown entity. A couple of years ago, I gave my old iPhone SE to my grandkids. They like to take a bunch of pictures and videos, so I went through it to delete stuff to make sure they have space. I was going through their phone on Christmas Eve 2018 when I came across this video. The audio was the first thing that caught my attention, and after listening to it a few more times, I was super creeped out and posted it on Facebook. That appears right after the voice says, I'll be fine. My grandbaby and I were the only two home that day. My husband's grandmother had lived with us for almost six years before she passed. And the foot of where her bed was is where the figure appears. The voice on the recording does not sound like his grandma and the black figure looks way too big. She was a tiny woman. Coincidentally, this video was recorded the day before grandma's birthday. Nothing strange ever happened there for me to even suspect anything. This video shook me to the core though. After two years this still creeps me out and I still think about this almost every day. What do you guys think? Could they capture the spirit of their grandma here? Or was something else visiting from another realm? Maybe even a shadow person? Jason has forwarded the following which was uploaded by user galdenga 252 and she tells the internet that yesterday she stumbled over a strange capture that she took one night when creating a couple of selfies for her profile. Her parents were downstairs at the time and nobody else should have been present. After all, she would remember that, right? However, the back of her room says otherwise. In closer inspection, there was another person with her which freaked her out a ton, and she's looking for help on the internet. Let's take a look. A 
woman is sitting right behind the uploader and people have pointed out that it is quite freaky how her eyes are just two dark holes. But we shouldn't forget that it could be due to the awful lighting conditions in the room. She also appears to be holding something, or if you want to believe other comments, might be even missing her left hand. So what are we looking at here? Just a friend of hers, sitting in the back that seems creepy due to the camera angle, or a paranormal apparition. This clip was sent by Andrea and she said that the following man was on a round trip and apparently noticing mysterious events unfolding in a public restroom. It is unclear what noises actually caused the man to get out his cell phone. But right after, he captures the first activity. This is certainly pretty creepy. I bet the man thought the same at the time. As he checks out the stall, that seemed to be empty at the time, he documents every little detail. Could he record a ghost lady in the mirror? Was she also tampering with the door of the stall? Hard to say. Thank you guys so much for watching. 